The Sun is huge. It contains 99.9% .9 of the total mass of the solar system. There is nothing more prominent in our skies and cultures have worshipped it for thousands of years. But how do we know just how big it is? Well today we're going to find out with nothing more than this shoebox. Hello everyone and welcome along to another Saturday session. Thanks for joining me, welcome back to the channel. The Sun has a diameter of 1,392,684 kilometers. We figured that out with unprecedented accuracy in 2003 and 2006, as scientists used a spacecraft to measure the transit of Mercury as it crossed the face of the Sun. Now Mercury transits only happen around 12 or so times every 100 years, so using this phenomenon was vital. But how could we, you and me, figure out a rough size of the Sun on our own? Well, it is possible, but we need a shoebox, some scissors, some tin foil, and our brains. Sorry Flat Earthers, you might want to sit this one out. Over to me, in the garden. So essentially, we're gonna make a pinhole camera with this shoe box here and some tin foil. So you'll see here that I've stuck a paper ruler on the back of this box here. I'll explain more about that in a minute. And I've already cut out a little sort of two by two centimeter hole here in the box, which we're gonna cover with tin foil now. Okay, there we go. Now, all I've gotta do next is take this little needle here and we're gonna make a hole in the tin foil like so. Probably can't see that, but there we go. I think we are now all set to measure the size of the sun. Now, if we face this little pinhole here directly towards the sun, which is what I've done, thankfully it's a sunny day here on the south coast. Now, believe it or not, this little projection back here, I don't know if you can see that. I'll zoom in. Now, believe it or not, I don't know if you can see that, that's a picture of the sun, a projection of the sun. Now, if you did this during a solar eclipse, then you would see the disk of the sun being covered by the moon in this little projection. So all we need to do now is take a measurement. We want to measure the diameter of the projected disk at the back of the shoebox. And we can see using this ruler that it is three millimeters, three millimeters. So now we've got to do a little math. Right, here we go. So the diameter of our projection was three millimeters. And to figure out the diameter of the actual sun, we need an equation. The diameter of the sun is the size of our projected image divided by the length of our box, multiplied by our current distance to the sun, which at the moment is 150,448,537 kilometers. So as we said, we know the size of our image, but we need to convert it from millimeters to kilometers. Now, three millimeters is 0 0.000003 kilometers. And we want the length of our box, which is 34.5 centimeters. But again, we need to convert that to kilometers. 35.5 centimeters is 0 0.000345 kilometers. And then we need to multiply that by the distance to the sun, which on the day of recording is 150,448,537 kilometers. And if we total all of that up, we get a sun diameter of 1,308,248 kilometers. And if we compare that to the established size of the sun, which we already know is 1,392,684 kilometers, then we can see we are only 84,000 kilometers out. Now, if you are a flat earther and you believe that the sun is only three or 4,000 miles up in the sky, then we can actually work out how big their sun would be based off our experiment. 4,000 miles is around 6,400 kilometers. So if we pop that into our equation, then on a flat earth, the sun would only be 92 kilometers across. I'll let you guys decide if that makes sense or not. Now, the larger box you use, the more accurate your result will be. So grab yourself a big box, try it yourself, and see if you can get a value for the 
uh, diameter of the sun, the size of the sun that's closer than mine. So there we go, figuring out the size of the sun using only a shoebox. Physics is amazing, isn't it? Thanks so much for watching everyone for another Saturday session. I'll see you again next time. Bye-bye.